Hi, I'm Gordon Marr, and I'm running for District 4 Supervisor to ensure that the Sunset District and San Francisco remain safe, affordable, and vibrant places for working families and people of all walks of life. I'm proud to have earned the endorsement of the San Francisco Democratic Party, the Sierra Club, the Deputy Sheriff's Association, the Bicycle Coalition, and the Teachers, Nurses, and Firefighters Unions, as well as dozens of other organizations and elected officials. I first, first moved to San Francisco in 1988 after graduating from UC Berkeley, drawn by the vitality of our neighborhoods and the diversity of our communities. My wife and I first moved to the Sunset District in 2005, mainly to raise our daughter, and Leanne is now in eighth grade at Hoover Middle School. Yet today, much of what drew me to this great city 30 years ago as a young person and to the family-friendly Sunset District 13 years ago feels at risk of being radically changed or wiped out by the affordability crisis and the dramatic economic changes that have been transforming our city over the past decade. I'm running for the Board of Supervisors to ensure that San Francisco remains a place where anyone, regardless of income or social condition, is able to live, work, raise a family, and retire with dignity now and into the future. This is also why I've been working on these issues as a nonprofit executive director and a community advocate for over 25 years in our city. I started out organizing immigrant families as executive director of the Chinese Progressive Association, where I led efforts to improve fire safety and substandard housing conditions in single room occupancy hotels, to improve working conditions and end wage theft in the restaurant industry, and to pass our city's first minimum wage law in 2003. I've been the director of the Northern California Citizenship Project, working to register new citizens to vote and engage immigrant communities in the political process in the nine county Bay Area region. I've been the, the campaign director of the Bay Area Environmental Health Collaborative, working to reduce air pollution in the region, especially in overburdened communities. And over the past eight years as executive director of Jobs with Justice, I've continued to lead efforts to raise the minimum wage a second time to $15 and to create our nation's first ever Retail Workers Bill of Rights. I was a leader in the community campaign to save City College from closure and to make it tuition free for all San Franciscans. And I've expanded access to home care services for seniors and people with disabilities, including the creation of the Support at Home program. So I'm running for the Board of Supervisors to bring my decades of experience on issues of importance to working people, families, seniors, and students to help address the critical issues facing our neighborhoods and our city. And for me, this is also personal. I think about my daughter and her friends and worry wh whether they'll be able to afford to live in the city they're being raised in. And I think about her coming to visit me at my office in the Tenderloin, stepping over needles and waste on the sidewalks, and so many of our community members living on the streets. In this center of global innovation and such immense wealth, I am certain that we can house our homeless and clean our streets. We can stop displacement and expand affordable housing we can care for our seniors, students, and anyone in need. And we can ensure that San Francisco continues to work for all of us. So I'm running for the Board of Supervisors to bring my decades of experience and my track record of accomplishments to address the critical issues facing our city and our neighborhoods. And I'm ready to get to work for the Sunset District in San Francisco on day one. Thank you.